take it off. First of all, there's been a M certain M5 chip at 15:30 UTC. That's a couple of hours back. But let's move on to today's shenanigans. <laughs> no, not shenanigans. Today's um, um, experiment. Basically, this is um, a series of experiments. Um, uh, it's very scientific in nature. It's a way of assessing yourself. It's kind of like you got to, when you're meditating, you got to see how the environment is affecting you. And um, as you're going through the day, you got to kind of see what um, how the environment affects you as you're going through the day as well. Like uh, if you can match your sudden mood changes to uh, naturally occurring phenomena like solar flares, shifts in magnetic poles, then at least you have something to buy onto, something, something, a starting point where you can um, start to, uh, what's it called, uh, come up with a solution, um, a way of coping, um, going around that or working with that, you know, be like water with it but you can't predict when the sun's going to flare off um, but it is going to affect you but um, when you're in the moment and you flared off yourself <laughs> um, you kind of um, you need to kind of stop going with the thought um, if you have a thought that is kind of different from a norm yeah, stop going with it until you find an explanation for why it was triggered and if it's a natural one then you know when the almighty acts it's alright it's never wrong <laughs> And you talk to yourself that way. Um, so, by monitoring um, the solar flares, that's one thing that I can monitor. That that's 15 minute delay from um, the actual um, time that the event happened. Um, <coughs> so, but it gives me an idea, a rough idea. I also, look at earthquakes as well, because the energy from them can also um, interfere with you. Um, but lots of things trigger us. Um, but just keep an eye on them. The experiment is about to start. Brace yourselves. <laughs> here we go, here we go, here we go. there's a blockage but it's just been an M class flare so maybe the residue energy from that <coughs> is kind of like uh, resonating around the world could be that I don't look at the Schumann resonance but um, um, there's quite a few people I watch that do so um, <coughs> I get updates on that <coughs> um, but there's very many metrics out there many people are looking at um, <coughs> this um, cut <laughs> to see how many <laughs> ways they can skin it but <laughs> it's all astrology to me you know yeah the second moon energy is um manifesting in so many different ways it's gonna affect us those who are <coughs> the dwellers on earth <laughs> yeah
So I have been keeping experimental results. Yeah, so um, there's a metric that I made uh, that I'm monitoring. <coughs> and um, because obviously these metrics were meant for another objective, I suppose. <coughs> but um, <coughs> I can use the data from that um, and got my own metrics that I'm monitoring that are m more useful parameters to what I'm doing, you know. <coughs> yeah, so. Um, <coughs> and they derived from the data set as well. From the results data, <coughs> yeah, in a way. <laughs> I don't know if you guys will get to see orbs and things around <laughs> flying around me, but um, <coughs> my narcissism is a bad thing, you know, <coughs> especially with people like like me around here, <laughs> because like um, <coughs> whatever soul I'm destroying. I don't even know, like, you know, <laughs> but I hope it's not a soul. I hope the blockage is due to uh, some natural occurrence, <coughs> you know. Well, whatever. I'm just clearing whatever is blocking my mind, you know. I don't care. <laughs> <coughs> mm -hmm. Warning: meditation in progress. <laughs> You put up a sign like that, ain't you? It's a crazy energy. <coughs> I'm not sure what it is, but kind of have to un unblock a few things. this off
So you've got to have your wits around you. You've got to be clever enough. Because um, at the end of the day, we're all going to be people who can say that we've got a power. Those of us who can connect to the divine spark inside of you. Yeah. Um, you can't act like you're the only one or think you're the only one who can. You know, and even if you don't want to accept it or not, at some point, you're going to get pinned by someone because, like, you know, <laughs> that's where logic comes into it. You know, um, you got to basically um, develop yourself, hone your skills, and um, prepare for, for, you know, the next stage. I say, if we're chosen ones, then it's Christ that will put us together because we won't know how to congregate. <laughs> you know, since he's in this world, he should be able to do that. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Next one. If they can't stop my power, <coughs> they should have left my mind a long time ago. If they haven't, all they're doing is cooking. I'm the chef. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I'm going to cook you. Obviously. <coughs> Michelin star and everything. <laughs> nah, I'm joking. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> That's the logical error, you know. You know, intelligent people are like guinea pigs, <coughs> or how do you put it, hamsters on a wheel, isn't it? <coughs> you keep asking him why, he keeps going round and round in circles. You could even put a little thorn <coughs> on the wheel, and it just <laughs> he'll shoot himself in the foot multiple times, <coughs> <coughs> just trying to prove that he's intelligent. Intelligence is a verb. <coughs> it's not something I identify as. It's something I do. Yeah. <coughs> so um, <coughs> you have to do intelligence, but you can't identify as intelligent. <coughs> that means you're a clown. That's like <laughs> a hamster on a wheel. <coughs> <coughs> intelligent people are prone to certain logical errors. <coughs> Different set of logical errors to from the non-intelligent people. So you can actually contrast. <coughs> Intelligent person is more likely to put his shoes on the wrong way around. <coughs> and a dumb person is more likely to make a grammatical <coughs> error in the math, in mathematics. Every day some dumb fucker tries to fight my power and every day he gets cooked a little bit more. <coughs> like he's a dummy. <coughs> mm -hmm. That's what I'm sensing anyway. <coughs> mm, but sometimes it could be a natural trigger that caused that thought <coughs> to be evoked in me. <coughs> we wait. <coughs> but I was getting that as a <coughs> theory <laughs> to the to what the blockage is. <coughs> I don't know what the blockage is. I never know. about the different 
levels of acquaintance that you have with the population. Some people <coughs> you're close like that. Some people you're close like that. Some people you're really close like that. <coughs> you must reinforce the boundaries <coughs> with people with respect to levels of closeness <coughs> you know that you have with them. <coughs> like if I'm busy um, you know cleaning up my mind from the daily static that builds up and then I hear somebody complaining like I'm, I'm disturbing them from using my mind and they're supposed to be this close but they're in my mind where well, you're only supposed to be that close if you're in that <coughs> then obviously you have to chase that out with it obviously the boundaries don't call for that <coughs> people will try all kinds of shit and then when you try to touch his stuff he carries on like you can't have none <coughs> and is there in your intimate space <coughs> people where we don't touch each other's intimate things can't touch my mind <coughs> that day will only be the only valid candidate will be wifey and girlfriend <coughs> otherwise nah <coughs> that's nasty already if you're somebody else's woman, you got no business touching my mind for anything. Whatever you want, your man should be able to supply it. Never equate to anyone for something like me, because obviously <coughs> I'm a cryptid and most man ain't like this. <coughs> yeah. So don't be hard on people. I want to be more like a high priest, live a double life like Siamese. I want to develop a life that I please, coronize the world like Chinese. <laughs> no, <coughs> it's very simple. <coughs> very, very simple. Very pimple. Very, very pimple. <coughs> Abomination. Wanna kill the people. <laughs> Some people be moving like hairy pimples, you know. <coughs> yeah. Kinda clearing, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Still an elevated sea. Yeah. In there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like that. Very crazy energy, you know.
who are always trying to explain the harsh realities of life but they don't want to hear them. <coughs> With me you get to choose what world you want to see. <coughs> Let me prepare uh, <coughs> all the parts. <laughs> Whichever way you like it, in my mind, I'm bossing that. I own all of it. <coughs> you gotta see me before you do anything. experience things in life <coughs> you know but things we don't talk about in public <coughs> but whenever you hear someone talking about stuff that you can relate to <coughs> even when we're being gaslit into thinking that somebody is crazy if you've experienced something and somebody talks about it <coughs> yeah you at least you know you know in it you know <coughs> so <coughs> gaslighting doesn't work yeah when it comes to experienced events <coughs> if we all see in the sun and somebody says we will have to believe that we're not seeing it that's hardly gonna work 100% now is it <coughs> nah, 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 nah. bullshit is not something that the human race has ever tolerated for too long you know That's why we use empirical measurement. Yeah. And that's why I'm looking at it this way. You know? Trying to get something empirical to get my teeth in, you know? And I have been keeping a record. You know, I've been keeping a record. something just hit my eye you know like how an x flare hits my eye <coughs> ah <laughs> i just got slapped at 1753 utc so probably 1610 utc yeah we might see a flare <coughs> from the uh <laughs> slap i just got might be a high m If it's coming from that far, <coughs> might not be. If it's if it's already elevated C, it might be. I'm not sure, but I just got like a a burning, you know, a sharp burning sensation. <coughs> yeah, across my eye, and last time I felt that was um <coughs> when it had flared up. 
it's just done at M two hours ago two and a half hours ago so I'm not sure but that felt like something hit <clears throat> yeah who my eye just went funny so watch out for it for that at 16 t um 1810 during this experiment we should see this graph go up <coughs> we should see this go up <coughs> yeah <coughs> mm -hmm. yeah but not yet my ADHD I should pay attention a bit more <laughs> ah dear mm. Mm. yeah indeed indeed but definitely something hit my eye <laughs> yeah this one <laughs> can't explain it <laughs> That's the eye where, where every time it flares, it's normally that eye that gets slapped. I don't know why. <laughs> so there might be a little flaring. We call that a prediction. <clears throat> you got to match it to sensations you get in your body. <clears throat> so I've noticed. It's like, <clears throat> just imagine if, um, how could I explain that? That It's a tingling sensation in the eye. Yeah. <clears throat> um imagine like if you if you got soap in your eye that little yeah it's a bit like that yeah like just as it just dropped that it's a bit like that when it's an X it proper feels like so soap in your eye <laughs> but that wasn't too big that wasn't too big that's what I reckon I could be wrong if I'm wrong then there's there was another source for that and I don't know which one it is <clears throat> oh my god you never hear the end of it if I'm right <laughs> no you will you will I forget quick <clears throat> I told you I get bored quick innit ADHD keep telling you not diagnosed though not diagnosed cause like uh, the treatment is still holding <clears throat> yeah but I read about the uh, condition and I reckon it's that and I treated it like that with CBT and it got better <coughs> yeah but um, to get professional help I got enough uh, <coughs> disorders <laughs> to last a lifetime that one I'll try and treat myself if I can't then yeah yeah but I think it's, it's doing alright on my meditation anyway <coughs> yeah my attention I can sit down for an hour I have been at least I make sure I can sit down for one hour a day <coughs> yeah and I do that mm -hmm. to learn to sit down and concentrate on one task mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. around the pores was absorbing um, x-rays from God knows what source so I suspect this the second moon in it <coughs> you could patch it <coughs> maybe it's just that disturbance that they're noticing in it I'm gonna do I'm being here with you uh, during the second moon um, energies here because they do affect us physiologically 
um, some of those effects might be scary because remember the last um, second moon thing and boy we went through quite a lot then <laughs> we we're going through a lot to start off with and then that um, the moon came <coughs> the second moon came said if they hated me they're gonna hate you so when you switch on your powers yeah you see Christ real quick <coughs> they'll come up with cartoon reasons to trouble you <coughs> yeah <coughs> yet you can't prove the powers like Santa innit <coughs> if you do have a power that everyone can detect they'll be acting like they're not detecting it but they'll come up with different reasons to, to mess with you <coughs> yeah <coughs> but if it's the kind of power that everybody knows, then <coughs> everybody knows, then <isn't> it? <coughs> there you go. <coughs> but it's the only power that I wanted, the power to defend my mind. <coughs> because to look for a power that attacks people, first of all, as a Christian, I, want, I, I wasn't interested in that. <coughs> if I was to choose a type of power, it would be a defensive one. And that's what I did. <coughs> yeah, With my divine spark, when I connected to it, I had a divine power that I went that way. <coughs> I'm sure there's energy about. Uh, I'm sure we're gonna see it. <coughs> we might not even see it until sixteen um, and eighteen fifteen. It's kind of between um, two two time points or something display points <coughs> so somebody's wound themselves up to believe that they have a right to fight me in my own mind narcissism is just rife man and it can be dangerous for you you know <coughs> yeah <coughs> where they all feel my power and then they somebody wound themselves up to believe that they have a right to attack me in my own mind can you imagine? He, evil is so camp in this world that they can't even contemplate doing that shit. <coughs> you never love a demon, you know, to the point where they get to that stage where they reckon <coughs> they have a right to attack people in their own minds. <coughs> what the hell is going on, man? <coughs> Once you give that right, they don't need to change nothing. <coughs> be slapping you in your mind when you come to, t to touch my mind. Nobody can tell me fuck off. I have to make sure my slap is done by the time that's, that time comes. Because right now, whatever goes into my mind experiences um, well, the zapping that I'm, that's happening in there. You know? And then when the Almighty acts, you'll get, be getting my zapping. And then you'll be jacked up <coughs> by um, whatever flare happens. So you get my slap and the Almighty's slap when you're in there. Now, the way I've noticed that. Um, these um, people with weird powers, including myself, the way weird powers work, apart from mine, mine doesn't work by going into other people's minds. But the way most powers work, <coughs> most offensive powers, <coughs> they come into your mind and they attack you from in there. And the way they do it, they start observing stuff you've done in the past. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> and the thing is, every past moment, I've had for the last eight years, has been full of this power. Yeah, I've been meditating hard. <coughs> so if you start foraging in my mind and looking around, you're gonna run into this from the past. <coughs> yeah. So by the time you get to love them enough to 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 make laws that gives them a right to our mind, if they touch that one, they die. If they touch my mind, they die. And it's already done. They'll start looking around and they'll be hit by something. Not what I'll be doing then, but what happened now or even before now <coughs> so I'm finished <laughs> you know 
but um, so watch out for the destruction that comes from when you love narcissists enough to, for them to believe that they have a right to attack us in, my mind, in our minds when they do that to me it's been an 8 year journey every moment I've had for the last 8 years has been having this power emanating in it so you step in there to do anything in there you get done People are carrying on like a cartoon, innit? Yeah, it's Santa Claus. I don't know. You told me. You're the one who believes in that. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't believe in shit. I know Santa. I've seen him once. <laughs> but we're not supposed to tell people who Santa is. It's a secret, innit? <laughs> mm -hmm. Fine. So I'm preparing my mind for that time when you love them enough for them to make laws that give them the right to our minds my mind would be a death trap for everyone at that time <clears throat> it's already done you do that <clears throat> yeah everybody burns <clears throat> I promise you <clears throat> and I've seen signs but all I'm seeing is synchronicity so uh, yeah good luck with that what can I say <clears throat> good luck thinking you might know but it was stuck between two so the next display point will be in 10 minutes from now we might see it on the next one it's, uh, it must have been that I'm sure it's gonna flip up even blip up a, bit, a little bit it must have been that what else could it have been mm. right, where are we where are we like they're gonna cry until you give them the right to do stuff to us and you're loving them enough to be head that way by the time you get there my mind will be sat in a tree river <laughs> <coughs> you stay off mine stay off my mind if you have any brains inside you and I've already started on those do you know the sneak attack you be you know how they say that um they invented technology and we don't know about it for 20 years <coughs> they've already and it's the same with sports when they fix that shit <coughs> when, when you show that you're certain they start monitoring you like you're in MK Ultra programs <laughs> if they find that you're too good and they can't trip you up they won't let you get anywhere near a stadium <laughs> it's the same with my power or your, when you when a new power comes into this world the first thing they do is send you acronym people turning up carrying on like their songs through <coughs> Prodigy and them ones <laughs> yeah that's already starting to happen so they've been checking me out they've been trying to compromise me they've been trying to figure out um, <coughs> how I tick yeah <coughs> when you come around to do battle bring, bring a body bag and shovel <laughs> not two shovels I was going to say two shovels <laughs> when you come around to do battle bring a body bag and shovel one shovel <laughs> yeah you're gonna need a body bag if you're gonna fuck with me like that <clears throat> it's already done even if I was to stop now if any of you sorcerer types here yeah, go into my mind and start looking around you get done you get tucked in straight I'm talking bedtime story <clears throat> sleepy booze <laughs> Carousel. Dun, 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 dun. I'll sleep like a baby that night, knowing that I killed somebody who was trying to take my life. <laughs> yeah. Sleep proper nice. Mickey Mouse bank blanket. Goofy ass alarm clock. Wind it up. <laughs> But if it's somebody who was innocent, I won't be able to sleep at night. <laughs> so that's why I had to make sure it's the right one. Because they can make us believe all kinds of things. They can make you believe that your trusted friends are attacking you. But when you have a power that, like mine, it's like this. 
if I close my eyes and there's a hot stove there and somebody touches it and there's two people that it could be and I believe that it's person A but it's person B that touched it it's person B that will have the mark on him from the burn that he got from touching it it doesn't matter what I believe in what happened is what happened so if I'm zapping my mind and I believe that it's that man that's touching it then it's another man that starts making noise like I'm affecting him then it's that one it doesn't matter what I believe in I don't deal with belief I believe with factual things <coughs> I don't do believe <coughs> just want to make sure that nothing touches my mind without paying for it <coughs> we're capitalists after all it's not a freebie <coughs> no one's shit free in this world go to see me before you see me <laughs> call it pay-per-view <coughs> you got to see me before you see me <coughs> otherwise this is the scrambling signal that I'm sending out nobody see me about seeing me <coughs> got to scramble that signal so you don't see me So that's how the protection comes. You know. Eight years of this, if you start looking around, you run into it. Whatever memory I had in the past, I would have been having when I'm zapping. Whatever experience I had in the past, I would have been having as I'm zapping in my mind. So if you draw up that experience from my Akashic, sometime forward in time, you get the experience and the zapping that was happening with it at the time. This is what I mean by logical errors leave my mind alone before you get slapped up <coughs> it's that simple it's not rocket science or anything oh look nothing happened oh no wait 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 this is the next um, time frame mm -hmm. could have been something must have been something else then unless he sanitized it the idiot if he sanitized it then it might have happened sanitized it and eat it no or 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 no 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 <coughs> no 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 nah there was there was nothing there I didn't there's nothing there <coughs> must definitely was something else <coughs> well if it wasn't that then I must have I must have destroyed some kind of demon then <coughs> that's the only other things it could be <coughs> so either I was destroying the sprite <coughs> yeah or I was hit by an x-ray <laughs> because if it's not nat something natural I can explain then I can fill in the gaps I've got theories loads of theories <coughs> I can't prove shit so I don't believe <coughs> I wait till I find uh, empirical evidence to support that So, thank goodness, thank the most high, if I can't hit the wrong one. <coughs> Even if I believe it's you, if it's not you, it won't be you I hit. <coughs> so, that's the kind of power I want. I don't want innocent blood in my head. time I was 
was looking at someone and I was zapping them in my mind. I thought, I feel a blockage like someone is touching my mind. And I was 100% sure it was him. But when I started zapping him, someone standing to the side of him started making noises, weird ass noises, like somebody zapping them. <coughs> so I was like, okay. <coughs> I thought it was that one, but it was that one. But I didn't bait it up. I didn't even look at him. I, thought I just kept it. And then when I was walking past him, then I briefly looked at him. But <coughs> I can't believe it. I thought, I was 100% sure it was the other guy. <coughs> but anyway, <coughs> someone was, was doing that, but it wasn't who I thought. But my power, obviously, I'm touching my mind, so whatever's touching that is the one that will get that. So <coughs> if you're not the one who's touching that, it won't be you who gets zapped up. <coughs> it's that simple. But if you are, you're going to get zapped up. That's not a freebie. <coughs> it's not a camping site. <coughs> That's my mind. <coughs> That's where I'm at. That's where the process that is me gets done. <coughs> you can't be in there doing nothing. the one who decides when it's enough in my mind <coughs> once I see the submission I want <coughs> then <coughs> then I could say that <coughs> if you're a demon you can see it like how King Solomon was when he built his temple with them <coughs> Yeah, you don't run me <coughs> I run you if I don't <laughs> You're not going to be in me for nothing. <coughs> Unless you submit to that. <coughs> yeah. You're not going to be in me for nothing. The only thing you're going to be in me for is a lovely time. <coughs> you're going to get slapped up. That's all you're going to get. You ain't getting no victory in that. kind of conversation oh I had a lovely time when you never won nothing <coughs> that's all you're going to be doing in there <coughs> and I'll be teeing you up has made up his mind that how did you wind yourself up to believe that you you have the right to fight me in my mind the submission I need is not that <clears throat> until I see it you're getting slapped up <clears throat> the only way you, t you can use jinn and demon is if you do what King Solomon done <clears throat> you go and ask the most high to give you one of that <laughs> one of them ones <clears throat> you have to understand remember in the beginning the scripture that writes it down somewhere I can't remember which one but it said all the angels were asked to kneel down to man and submit to man but one refused <coughs> so if you're an angel you would understand that you have to kneel those who don't understand that they have to kneel I know it's very easy to figure out which one is which when you're looking at angels and demons 
If you're an angel, what did the Almighty ask you to do when you see me? If you're not kneeling and you've got special powers, you look, if you've got special powers, you're one or two things. You're either an angel or a demon. <coughs> if you're an angel, new. <coughs> if you're a demon, I know. <coughs> I know. <coughs> you're going to get teed up either way still. stop my power all you're doing is getting a slapping if you touch a hot stove as you're trying to put it out if you touch it for an hour your fingers gonna burn <laughs> if you touch it for a second and it goes out no problem but to try and put it out for an hour your hands gonna look a state Start trying to cool down something with your hands for an hour. Your hands are gonna start to look a state. Try to stop my power for eight years. You'll be looking like a jacket potato with a slit in it. You piece of shit. angels and demons to me <coughs> those are things that were told to me down <coughs> those that refuse it's very simple man <coughs> what's the rest of that story <laughs> oh yeah they had a champion <coughs> a champion angel that refused to to, to <coughs> to kneel. Oh yeah, that became Satan, didn't it? Oh yeah, that's why he got thrown out of there. <coughs> mm. <coughs> mm. And took 33% of them. So I expect 33% of what's seeing in there, if it's a fractal <coughs> of the Most High, since the Divine Power, I suspect that 33% 30, of them will be uh, adversely affected, if you like. <coughs> when I apply the Almighty's power. So the submission I expect to see from those who have the power to see into my mind. <coughs> you knew, yeah? You stupid. <coughs> I'm man. I don't have the power to go anywhere in my mind. <coughs> Out of my mind, I mean. <coughs> the only place I am is in my mind. <coughs> if you have the power to see there, I've never known no human being who does. <coughs> the only things that have power to see there are angels or demons. <coughs> we need to know which one you are. If you're standing there, okay then. That's not what the Almighty told you, right? <coughs> if they sing into my mind and they're not kneeling, I know I'm surrounded by deep. Come on, man. It's simple, man. Go read the Bible. No, actually, it's scripture that might be beyond the Bible that I've read that in. <coughs> oh, yeah, you're an idiot. You wouldn't have found it. You had the water down, man. Okay, okay, okay. 
<coughs> yeah, anyway, since scripture that um, <coughs> they was told to kneel before man, so if they're using powers to see into our mind and they refuse to kneel when they asked, <coughs> they said it's not as they asked them. Okay, then. Well, since I don't know which one you want, I'm just going to keep slapping everything because, like, uh, I ain't seen you kneeling down. <coughs> he Almighty asked you, how come you ain't done that yet? <coughs> you have the power to see. You have the audacity to complain about what's in my mind. When you complain about what's in my mind, you're proving that you're seeing it. And if you're seeing it there, I need to figure out if you're an angel or a demon, man. If you're not kneeling, I've figured it out, innit? <coughs> no one kneels to me, so everybody's getting slapped. Everything that's seen there will get slapped up, because no one kneels to me. <coughs> Which means whatever seen there wouldn't have knelt to me. Everything's getting slapped up in there. Well, that's how you know, innit? <laughs> if I'm a nothing, no one knows to me. No one knows. To, well, yeah, look. <coughs> it's like that, man. Look. <coughs> look. You're going to get slapped up for one reason or another. So I'm just trying to give you quite a few reasons that it might be. <coughs> By the way, if my mind already made up, I'm just trying to come up with reasons anyway, yeah? <coughs> yeah, I think I told you on that. Oops. And that mm. fuck you like that. Mm. Mm. Nah, that wasn't that wasn't what I felt. It was something else. At least I cleared it. Whatever it was, I cleared it. Yeah, very good, very good, very good. This time it's been tighter, tighter. Uh, it's randomness anyway. Uh, I'm looking at my results, but all I see is synchronicity. <laughs> at best. <laughs> yeah. Nothing really out of the ordinary. As a scientist, yeah. <coughs> no, I'm not doing s uh, uh, officially recognized science <coughs> or uh, mainstream science, <laughs> but it is a science experiment, and I have got res. <coughs> The science method, <coughs> there you go, is being applied rudimentarily, <coughs> of course. This is entertainment after all. I don't want to bore people to death. <coughs> but I did graduate in science. I'm actually a master of science. Um, so, but... To be resp a responsible scientist, you don't do scientists, you don't do science stuff on social media, man. <laughs> you do it in the laboratory. On social media, you give them a taste. Yeah? I don't open a book. I've never opened a book on these social networks. Never. That would be irresponsible. People try to outdo each other with science. You bore people, they don't understand shit, and you're revealing everything, you dumb fuck. But in an entertaining, entertaining way, entertaining way get me well you're touching it but you don't give away fuck all <laughs> but um yeah this is a free experiment that even people should do for themselves you know <clears throat> as they're trying to figure out how to navigate through life when the sun will be doing that other things will be popping off like that <clears throat> yeah just good advice you know useful advice but it sounds a bit like astrology <clears throat> yeah but um there's a scientific basis, man. If you use the science method, you know, more statistics anyway. <coughs> Empirical based evidence to prove hypothesis.
hypothesis in it <coughs> and to develop to develop theory <coughs> hold up so far <coughs> my hypothesis <coughs> is <coughs> a secret <laughs> but I uh, haven't been able to come up I, I keep coming up with theories and I keep making up stuff in it <coughs> those are theories I'm coming up with That's a full hour that the stupid ass demon got slapped up for. Yeah, touching my mind like he's a clown or something. Um, but yeah, that's done. That's done. Um, uh, that energy. Now I'm mystified. I try and find out what it is, but as long as the two moons, as uh, the the two moon energies around here. Yeah? Um, the 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 asteroid that that that's in orbit is so small that uh, it will be a microscopic fluctuation uh, in the <laughs> in every field. Yeah, but consciousness, like I said, is the only one that's capable of detecting the um, microscopic displacements, <laughs> if you like. <laughs> yeah. Um, unless you have a specialist equipment like these guys where they have satellites out there with sensitive um, equipment on it but uh, in the day to day life it's just your consciousness that you got to do use to detect that maybe the tide might be a, a slight micrometer um, <laughs> stronger than usual but who's going to detect that <laughs> or oh, oh, a micrometer far far away when it goes out but who's gonna detect that <laughs> yeah so um there is a, f a, f a two moons energy that has to be but um yeah that's today's one anyway done